This is interesting. Naturally. Both enlightening and entertaining. Join us. If you've received the concerning diagnosis of fatty liver or non-alcoholic fatty liver disease NAFOLD, fret not, for within this enlightening discourse lies the beacon of hope a pathway to complete reversal. Welcome back to the Longevity Deprocess channel. In this complete guide will assist you through the labyrinth of metabolic health and unravel the precise blueprint for reclaiming your liver's vitality. Embark with me on this journey of restoration, where each step is meticulously crafted to not only reverse the ailment, but to expedite the process, ushering transformative changes within weeks. Together, we shall navigate the labyrinth of nutrition, discerning the foods that serve as allies in this battle against liver afflictions and those that pose as formidable adversaries. Picture a dining table adorned with nature's bounty vibrant hues of leafy greens, succulent fruits, and lean proteins, each morsel brimming with nutrients essential for liver rejuvenation. Conversely, we shall cast aside the culprits of inflammation and fat deposition the sugars, refined carbohydrates, and processed trans fats that lurk insidiously in modern diets, wreaking havoc on our metabolic sanctuaries. Oh, a quick favor, we'd greatly appreciate it. If you can subscribe and like, this helps the YouTube algorithm recognize the value of our content and share it more widely. But our odyssey doesn't end with dietary alterations alone. No, for I shall illuminate additional pathways to bolster your liver's resilience. From lifestyle modifications to exercise regimens tailored for liver health, every facet of your existence shall align with the rhythm of rejuvenation. And as our narrative reaches its zenith, I shall unveil the elixirs of supplementation, potent concoctions derived from nature's pharmacy, meticulously formulated to bolster your liver's convalescence. With each capsule, a promise of restoration. With each dosage, a step closer to normalcy. So, my fellow seekers of wellness, heed my call as we embark on this journey towards metabolic mastery. Together, armed with knowledge and determination, we shall navigate the currents of adversity, emerging triumphant on the shores of vitality and longevity. Welcome to a world where health is not merely a destination, but a way of life. Let us delve deeper into the intricate tapestry of knowledge, unwinding the mysteries of reversing fatty liver. To embark upon this voyage of understanding, we must first illuminate the shadowy corridors where the causes of this ailment lurk. At its core, Fatty liver finds its genesis in a simple yet profound truth the relentless onslaught of sugars, with fructose and sucrose emerging as the primary culprits in this narrative of metabolic turmoil. Picture, if you will, the ubiquitous presence of sucrose, that familiar white powder adorning our tables, innocuously concealing its transformative powers. Within moments of ingestion, sucrose metamorphoses into its insidious components fructose and glucose triggering a tumultuous cascade of physiological upheavals. This orchestrated symphony of metabolic chaos not only ensnares the liver in a web of lipid deposition, but also casts its ominous shadow over the realm of health birthing maladies ranging from diabetes to heart disease, from dementia to the insidious specter of cancer itself. Yet, amidst this labyrinth of metabolic mayhem, fructose stands as a unique protagonist, its siren call devoid of the customary signals of satiety. Beholden to no master, it bypasses the sentinel hormone leptin, leaving in its wake a trail of insatiable hunger and unquenchable cravings. A captive audience to the whims of fructose, our brains remain oblivious to the call of fullness, ensnared in a perpetual cycle of consumption and craving. Behold, dear traveler, the findings of a seminal study published in the Annals of the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition, a testament to the swift and insidious grip of fructose on the liver's fate. In a mere seven days of indulgence, the liver succumbs to the relentless onslaught, its once pure corridors infiltrated by the insidious tendrils of lipid deposition, its insulin sensitivity dwindling with each passing moment. But fear not, for in the labyrinth of dietary choices lies the key to liberation. Cast your gaze upon the ancient wisdom of our forebears, who reveled in the bounty of nature's harvest, embracing fruits and root vegetables without fear or hesitation. It is only in the throes of modernity, with the advent of manufactured fructose and rampant sugar consumption, that the scales of balance have tipped perilously askew. Yet, even amidst the chaos, glimmers of hope emerge from the verdant tapestry of nature's bounty. Fruits and vegetables, adorned with fiber and teeming with vital nutrients, stand as stalwart guardians against the encroaching tide of metabolic malaise. 
With every bite, we ingest not only sustenance, but also resilience, fortifying our bodies against the ravages of excess fructose. And lo, behold the transformative power of vitamin C, wielded as a shield against the nefarious effects of fructose. Within its molecular embrace, lies the promise of salvation, a bulwark against the ravages of metabolic tyranny. So, dear seeker of truth, heed these words as you navigate the labyrinth of metabolic health. Arm yourself with knowledge, and let the wisdom of ages past be your guiding light in the quest for restoration and rejuvenation. Let us embark on a journey through the labyrinth of dietary revelations, where each twist and turn unravels the mysteries of metabolic restoration. As we cast our gaze upon the dietary landscape, we encounter the first formidable foe in our quest to reverse the affliction of fatty liver, the treacherous realm of sugary beverages. Ah, sugary drinks, the sirens of modernity, beckoning with promises of refreshment, while concealing their malevolent intentions beneath a veil of sweetness. We are all too familiar with the perils of sodas and soft drinks, their dangers emblazoned upon the annals of health discourse. Yet, lurking in the shadows lie their cunning counterparts, the seemingly innocuous juices. Behold, the paradox of juices often lauded as virtuous elixirs of health, yet concealing within their glistening depths a surfeit of sugars. Orange juice, apple juice, tomato, cranberry a veritable cornucopia of flavors, each masking the insidious truth of their sugar-laden contents. Let not their innocent facade beguile you, for within lies a tempest of concentrated sweetness, devoid of the protective embrace of fiber that accompanies whole fruits. Pause, and scrutinize the labels that adorn these vessels of temptation. Behold the stark revelation of grams upon grams of sugars, masquerading beneath the cloak of natural or zero grams added. Yet, heed this warning, natural or not, the potency of concentrated sugars remains unchanged, a potent elixir that bypasses the barriers of satiety, ensnaring the unwary in its sticky embrace. But, the labyrinth of sugary perils extends beyond the realm of juices, encompassing the nefarious realms of sports drinks and energy elixirs. These potions, masquerading as aids to vigor and vitality, conceal within their effervescent depths a deluge of sugars, a veritable onslaught upon the beleaguered liver. Consider, if you will, the counsel of the Venerable American Heart Association, urging restraint in the consumption of sugars, setting a modest threshold of 24 to 36 grams per day. Yet, in the crucible of fatty liver affliction, such moderation pales in comparison to the imperative of abstinence. For those besieged by the scourge of hepatic malaise, let not a drop of sugary libation pass thy lips, lest it fan the flames of metabolic turmoil. Thus, dear seeker of dietary wisdom, arm yourself with discernment as you navigate the tumultuous seas of nutritional choice. Let not the siren song of sweetness lead you astray, but rather, anchor yourself in the fortress of knowledge, where the keys to metabolic restoration await. As we navigate the labyrinth of dietary wisdom, let us cast our gaze upon another enigmatic terrain fraught with hidden perils, the realm of dried fruits. Yes, dear traveler, even amidst the verdant orchards of nature's bounty, lies a treacherous path strewn with dried dates, raisins, and prunes, concealing within their shriveled forms the concentrated essence of sweetness. Behold, the paradox of dried fruits touted as wholesome treasures bestowed upon us by the bounty of the earth. And yet, within their desiccated husks, lies a potency that belies their innocent appearance. While devoid of added sugars, these natural delicacies harbor within their folds a concentrated reservoir of sugars, bereft of the voluminous fiber that once accompanied their fresh counterparts. Picture, if you will, the humble date, once plump and succulent, now reduced to a wrinkled relic of its former glory. Though its sweetness remains undiminished, its diminutive form belies its formidable potency. Similar tales unfold with raisins and prunes, each bearing the weight of concentrated sugars, capable of overwhelming our gastrointestinal tract and laying siege upon the beleaguered liver. Consider the findings of a recent expedition into the annals of medical literature. A study published in the esteemed journal JAMA in 2019 unfurled its banner of discovery, revealing the transformative power of sugar restriction. In a mere eight weeks, adolescent boys who curtailed their sugar intake to less than 3% of daily calories witnessed a miraculous improvement in hepatic cytosis, a testament to the profound impact of dietary choices on metabolic health. 
Thus, let us tread cautiously through the orchards of temptation, discerning the hidden dangers that lie beneath the guise of natural sweetness. As we navigate the culinary landscape, let wisdom be our compass, guiding us away from the siren song of dried fruits and towards the verdant pastures of nutritional abundance. Behold, dear seeker of metabolic harmony, for yet another path unveils itself in our quest to mend the ailing liver, the pathway of protein. As we journey through the corridors of nutritional enlightenment, let us heed the whispers of wisdom that beckon us towards the nourishing embrace of this vital macronutrient. Picture, if you will, the breaking dawn of a new day, where the first meal emerges as a pivotal juncture in the tapestry of metabolic health. A recent expedition into the realms of scientific inquiry, chronicled in the annals of obesity, unfurled its findings upon the canvas of human experience. Across the vast expanse of Australia, over 9,000 souls became unwitting participants in this grand experiment, their dietary choices scrutinized with a keen eye. Behold the revelation. Those who partook of a protein-rich breakfast embarked upon a transformative journey, their culinary choices guided by the nourishing influence of this vital nutrient. With each savory morsel, they paved the way towards satiety, laying siege upon the insidious cravings that haunt the corridors of metabolic turmoil. As the day unfolded, they found themselves less beholden to the siren song of energy-dense processed foods, their cravings quelled by the sustaining power of protein. Yet, contrast this with the plight of those who commence their day with a paltry offering of protein, their journey marred by the relentless pursuit of sugary confections and processed indulgences. Bereft of the satiating embrace of protein, they succumb to the whims of insatiable hunger, their cravings steering them towards the abyss of metabolic dysfunction, so, dear traveler, take heed of this revelation, and let protein be thy ally in the battle against fatty liver affliction. Aim to infuse each meal with a bounty of protein, a shield against the onslaught of sugary temptations. Be it breakfast, lunch or supper, let each plate be adorned with the life-giving essence of 25 to 35 grams of protein, a testament to your commitment to metabolic restoration. And lo, let us not underestimate the transformative power of weight loss in the saga of liver rejuvenation. A mere 5% reduction in total body weight heralds a dawn of hope, diminishing the specter of hepatic steatosis with each pound shed. Nay, press further, and let 7% of total body weight loss herald the clarion call of complete resolution, banishing the shadows of non-alcoholic steatohepatitis Nash from our metabolic landscape. Thus, dear seeker of wellness, let protein be thy compass, guiding thee towards the shores of metabolic harmony. As we navigate the tumultuous seas of dietary choice, may the bounty of protein nourish our bodies and illuminate the path towards liver restoration. Ah, the intricate dance of macronutrients unfolds before us, casting its spell upon the canvas of metabolic health. As we ascend the pinnacle of protein-rich diets, let us not falter in our quest, but rather, Heed the cautionary whispers that echo through the corridors of dietary wisdom. Behold, dear traveler, the bounty of animal meats and dairy products, beckoning with promises of protein-rich sustenance. Yet, amidst this cornucopia of culinary delights, lurks a shadowy adversary, saturated fats. These stealthy intruders, found nestled within the folds of red meat, processed meats, butter, and the siren song of ice cream, pose a formidable threat to the sanctity of our metabolic sanctuaries. The debate over the consumption of red meat rages on, a tempest of conflicting opinions swirling in the gusts of dietary discourse. While some champion moderation in its consumption, others tread cautiously, wary of its potential pitfalls. Yet, amidst the cacophony of voices, a study published in Diabetes and Metabolism delivers a sobering revelation, an excess of saturated fats wreaks havoc upon the liver, eclipsing even the perils of fructose overfeeding. Pause and contemplate the findings of human intervention studies, each a beacon illuminating the treacherous shoals of dietary excess. In a double-blind, randomized controlled trial, lean individuals were subjected to an onslaught of muffins laden with either saturated fatty acids or their polyunsaturated counterparts. In just seven weeks, the scales tipped dramatically, with the saturated fat group witnessing a marked increase in liver fat, while their polyunsaturated counterparts emerged unscathed. Moderation, dear traveler, is our guiding principle, for within its embrace lies the path to metabolic harmony. 
Limit thy intake of saturated fats to less than 5% of total calories, steering clear of processed meats, fried delicacies, and the seductive allure of ice cream and cheeses. Yet, amidst the labyrinth of caution, let us not forsake the bounty of good fats, the polyunsaturated and monounsaturated treasures that grace our plates with their nourishing embrace. Feast upon the bounty of fish, nuts, and avocados, and let olive oil be thy preferred companion in the realm of culinary alchemy. And for those who embark upon the hallowed path of ketogenic diets, let prudence be thy guiding light. Embrace the efficacy of this metabolic marvel, but tread cautiously, ensuring that the majority of thy fat intake emanates from the benevolent embrace of polyunsaturated and monounsaturated fats. Thus, dear seeker of dietary wisdom, let balance be thy compass, guiding thee towards the shores of metabolic harmony. As we navigate the turbulent seas of nutritional choice, let the wisdom of moderation and discernment be our steadfast companions in the quest for lifelong health and vitality. In the realm of metabolic mastery, the ketogenic diet stands as a formidable ally in the battle against fatty liver, its efficacy heralded by many who have traversed its hallowed halls. Yet, for some, the rigors of severe carbohydrate restriction prove too daunting a challenge to sustain over the long term. Fear not, dear traveler, for amidst the shifting sands of dietary doctrine, a beacon of hope emerges the revelation that carbohydrate elimination is not the sole path to liver rejuvenation. Enter the realm of carbohydrate quality, where the subtleties of glycemic index hold sway over the fate of our metabolic sanctuaries. Picture, if you will, a world where carbohydrates are not demonized, but rather scrutinized for their impact on blood sugar stability. In this realm, carbohydrates with a low glycemic index reign supreme, their gentle embrace sparing the liver from the tumultuous roller coaster of glucose spikes. Thus, as we navigate the labyrinth of dietary choices, let us prioritize carbohydrates from sources such as legumes, dairy, vegetables, and fruits, their low glycemic index bestowing upon them the mantle of liver-friendly nourishment. Conversely, shun the specter of high glycemic index carbohydrates the white breads, white rices, and processed potatoes that wreak havoc upon our metabolic balance. But lo, the saga of fatty liver reversal extends beyond the confines of dietary choices alone. Abstinence from alcohol stands as a cornerstone of liver restoration, alongside the rhythmic cadence of moderate intensity activity, with a sprinkle of resistance training to fortify the body's bulwarks against metabolic malaise. Should you embark upon this odyssey of liver restoration with diligence and resolve, rejoice in the promise of transformation that awaits. In the matter of weeks, the echoes of change shall reverberate through your liver biomarkers, heralding the dawn of rejuvenation. Yet, heed this solemn warning, delay not in your quest, for the specter of non-alcoholic steata hepatitis Nash and its ilk looms ominously on the horizon, casting a shadow over the promise of recovery. But fear not, for in your arsenal lies the power of supplementation, a potent elixir to enhance the efficacy of your dietary endeavors. Though not a requisite for liver rejuvenation, supplements may serve as catalysts in your journey towards wellness, augmenting the healing properties of real, whole foods. Thus, let the wisdom of ages past be your guide, as you embark upon this noble quest to reclaim the vitality of your liver. With each morsel of nourishment and each stride of exertion, let the promise of restoration guide your steps, leading you towards the shores of metabolic harmony and lifelong health. Behold, amidst the vast landscape of dietary interventions, a glimmer of hope emerges from the realm of supplements, promising to expedite the journey towards liver restoration. Among these elixirs of rejuvenation, one shines with particular brilliance, vitamin E. Imagine, if you will, the transformative power of vitamin E, its potency harnessed in doses of 800 international units per day. In the annals of medical inquiry, this humble nutrient has emerged as a beacon of hope, guiding many towards the shores of hepatic recovery. Studies have shown that therapy with vitamin E yields a significantly higher rate of improvement in non-alcoholic steata hepatitis NASH when compared to placebo, a testament to its healing prowess. Yet, tread cautiously, dear seeker of wellness, for the path to supplementation is fraught with nuance and complexity. For embarking upon a regimen of vitamin E, I implore you to engage in dialogue with your trusted physician. High doses of this potent nutrient, exceeding 400 international units per day, have been entangled in controversy, with whispers of increased all-cause mortality and heightened risk of prostate cancer lingering in the corridors of medical discourse. 
Thus, the decision to supplement with vitamin E is not one to be taken lightly, reserved primarily for those grappling with advanced stages of fatty liver disease. Let the wisdom of your healthcare provider be your guiding light in this endeavor, navigating the delicate balance between therapeutic benefit and potential risk. As you traverse the labyrinth of liver restoration, let the promise of supplementation serve as a beacon of hope, augmenting the healing journey embarked upon through dietary means. With prudence and discernment, may the transformative power of vitamin E illuminate your path towards lifelong health and vitality. On the path to liver restoration, let us delve deeper into the realm of supplementation, where the whispers of healing beckon us towards newfound vitality. Among the treasures of this domain, three jewels stand out with particular luster omega-3 fatty acids, choline, and betaine. Imagine, if you will, the wondrous efficacy of omega-3 fatty acids, their healing touch documented in the annals of clinical inquiry. A meta-analysis, unveiled in the hallowed pages of clinical nutrition, unveiled a revelation supplementation with omega-3s, particularly the potent fish oils rich in DHA, heralded a symphony of improvement in liver markers such as ALL and ASD. Moreover, it orchestrated a ballet of reduction in liver fat, casting a transformative spell upon the beleaguered liver. Yet, let us not overlook the humble choline, emerging as a rising star in the pantheon of fatty liver treatments. A recent case control study cast its spotlight upon this vital nutrient, revealing a remarkable association those who partook of high intake of choline and betaine witnessed an astounding 81% reduction in hepatic steatosis. However, tread cautiously, for the landscape of choline supplementation remains shrouded in uncertainty. Further research is warranted to ascertain its universal efficacy and determine the optimal dosage for therapeutic benefit. In the absence of conclusive evidence, let us turn to the bounty of nature's pantry for our choline needs. Feast upon the golden yolks of eggs, savor the succulence of lean meats, and partake of the nourishing embrace of seafood, rich in both choline and omega-3 fatty acids. And for those who eschew meat, fear not, for yogurt, sunflower seeds, and cruciferous vegetables stand ready to bestow their gifts of choline upon thee. Let's not let our exploration end here, for the realm of supplementation teems with untold riches yet to be unearthed. In future videos, we shall delve deeper into this treasure trove, uncovering the myriad supplements that hold promise in the quest for liver rejuvenation. If you found this video informative or helpful, don't hesitate to explore our Liver Club playlist for more valuable content. Feel free to share your health journey in the comments section below, as we believe in learning from one another's experiences. Thank you for tuning in, and as always, I extend my best wishes for your continued health, wealth, and happiness. Remember, the key to vitality is in your hands.